Yo, what's up YouTube? My name is Ben and in today's video, I'll be showing you guys how to add music to your video using iMovie. So even though iMovie is a really basic editor, if you're brand new to YouTube and you're just looking to get some basic edits done, it'll get the job done for you guys. So with that being said, let's go over there and hop in to my laptop. Welcome to the inside of my computer. So obviously first what you want to do is open up iMovie. And to open up iMovie, just go to the top right corner of your screen and click on the magnifying glass and type in iMovie into the search bar and press enter. Guys, once iMovie pops up onto your screen, what you first want to do is import all of your video clips. And to do this, you just click on this arrow right here above import media and just scroll down and find your video clips. Say I wanted to use all five of these video files, I would just click on the first video file and hold shift on my keyboard and click the last video file and it's going to select all the files in between the first and the last video file. So that's a pretty convenient way to upload or import all of your, of your videos in a bulk way. But say I wanted to upload only the first, the third and the fifth audio file. I would hold command on my keyboard, click the first one, the third one, and the fifth one, and then press enter to import it. But in this example, I'm just going to be using this second video file right here. So just select it and press enter on your keyboard and it'll import it into your workspace right here. So now that you have all of your video files imported to the workspace, go ahead and just click on the video file and drag them into your your movie section right here and you guys can import all of your videos and just drag them into the exact order you guys want and also just finish up your editing you know all add all the cuts add all the transitions or even the titles if you guys want um but yeah for this video specifically i'm going to show you guys how to add your music so once you guys added all of your video files you guys want Go ahead and click on this little arrow right here to import your music and it'll bring you back to the exact screen you guys were before. But in this case, we're going to be uploading our music file. So I'm going to be choosing this music file right here. Click on it and press enter and it'll show up in the workspace right here. And it's the exact same way you guys just click on it, drag and drop. Only this time you're going to be dragging it under the video file to this audio section of the timeline. So click, drag and drop and just place it under here and just bring it to the beginning. So if your audio file exceeds the length of your video file, what you guys can do is just scroll to the right and go to the end of the audio file, click on it and just drag it towards the end of the video file and iMovie should slap, snap in place where the end of the video file and audio file me i know this doesn't line up but trust me guys it does line up and um yeah it lines up and it stops at the exact same time even though it's not actually lined up so yeah um either way guys what you want to do to your audio files is add a little fade to it so that it doesn't abruptly end or start so what you guys want to do is go ahead and click on this little circle right here and just drag it to the left and this will add a little fade to your audio and also you want to go to the beginning of your audio file and do the exact same thing but drag it to the right so this adds a little fade to your audio it doesn't start or end too abruptly and this makes your video your audio sound smoother and makes your video more professional so what you guys also i want to show you guys is um, how to increase or decrease the volume of your audio clip. So just go ahead and scroll over or hover your mouse over the line right here. Um, and you guys can either drag it up or down depending if you want to increase or decrease your volume. So in this case, I'm using this as background music. So I'm going to drag it around 10%. You guys can always test it out and play the clips to see if it is good. But in this case, I'm just gonna keep it at around 10%. That sounds pretty good to me. So once you guys have that, you guys can also um, 
you know, add another audio clip. Just drag it in again if you guys want to. If you guys have a longer video, just keep on dragging it just to repeat the process and also add the little fades at the end so it doesn't, you know, uh, stop or begin too abruptly. Also, if you guys want to upload music from your iTunes account, you guys can click on audio right here and click on iTunes on this left side and your music should show up right here. Obviously, I'm a big Ariana Grande fan, so if you guys want to use this audio clip, just go ahead and do the exact same thing. Just select, drag and drop and just drop it into a timeline like that. In this case, I'm not going to be using this. So say if I wanted to add a sound effect, you guys would do the exact same thing as you guys did before. Just click, drag and drop it into right in between the uh, video and audio clip. So I'll just put it right there. You guys can see it. I remember before deciding to take this forward. It adds that little walkie talkie static effect into the video clip. So that's pretty much how you guys add sound effects or music to your iMovie videos. Uh, it's pretty simple. It's easy to use and it gets the job done. If you guys want to, you know, add or make more complex edits, go ahead and use Final Cut Pro or Premiere Pro. But for a beginner, like I said, it's uh, it's pretty effective and it gets the job done. So that that concludes the uh, this video right here, guys. If this video helped you guys out, be sure to like the video and also subscribe if you're new for future content. And also hit the notification bell so you guys don't miss anything out. You guys don't miss out on any content as well. So with that being said, guys, thanks for watching. My name is Ben and uh, I'm out. Peace.